Right then, welcome to Bailey shooting. Um, we're out right now on one of the bits of ground. Um, I cover controlling the foxes for the lambing fields next door. Uh, but while we were here, I thought I'd uh, have a little chat to you about the new Vortex Fury 5000 HDs. Um, that's these here. Put the caps on so I protect my lenses. Um, same body design as the previous Fury 5000s. Uh, any difference is you've got some additional buttons which correlate to the applied ballistics which are built in. So you've got the same fantastic glass, optical clarity at range and at low light um, with the range finder on there and also now um, through the support of the Vortex app for this, the Fury app, uh, you can enter your ballistic data onto the app which transfers it to these and you can get your solutions when shooting straight off the binos rather than having to uh, go onto Stralock or onto an app or onto a Kestrel or anything like that. These do connect to a Kestrel as well. So, tall and short of it is, you've entered your data, I see a fox at 385 yards, I range it with these, and in the display it actually tells me what I need to dial on my optic to hit the target. That's how simple it is. So um, we'll go from this and I'll show you some footage looking through at some various targets that we've shot uh, and then we'll have a little chat about the specs on this unit. So yeah, keep watching. Cheers. Right then, this isn't the best way to do this because I can't get the angle to tie up with the screen. But what we're going to do is, if I go over onto... We've got a target just there. It's awkward as hell. So we're going to range that 350 yards. And as you can see at the top, it says up 1.1. So what we're going to do, go up 1.1, get on the gong. 1.1. There you go. So that worked perfectly and then if we go over this way we're just going to pick some random thing uh, tell you what you've got a molehill here yeah. two hundred and thirty seven yards and it's going to say up point two. Up point two. So if I go onto that, go to up point two, close the bolt. Hopefully, I'm on the right one. There we go. So, as you can see, it works. Right then, so now you've actually seen the binos in action doing their job. Um, we're just going to go through some of the core basics on the unit themselves. So, 10 by 42, that's their magnification. Here's the box they come in. 10 by 42, um, 32.4 ounces their overall weight. High relief is 16 millimeters. Uh, field of view at 1,000 yards is 321 feet. And the uh, elevation that it will read on angles is plus or minus 89, um, which is a bloody good range, degrees. Uh, ranging, minimum range and distance on these is 5 yards, uh, maximum on a deer is 1600 yards, it's 2400 yards on a tree line or a single tree, and then 5000 yards on a full reflective surface, side of building or large target etc. So a really good range uh, for that. Um, inside these binos you've also got um, a reader for barometric pressure as well as uh, a digital compass and temperature which is absolutely bang on so that can help with your ballistics when you've got them programmed in there to make sure it calculates the correct shot for you. Um, in the box you will get a bino harness inside here you'll get the neck strap and you get the lens covers for the front and the back. Um, targeting modes on this unit you've got best mode which is the one we all use you point at it you press the button and it pings you the range or you've got last mode and what that'll do if you're trying to range a target behind a tree line or behind some cover it'll actually take the furthest reading and send that to you rather than giving the reading to the closer tree line 
which is also pretty pretty ideal. Um, it's got horizontal component distance, HCD. Basically what that means is if you're shooting downhill, and this is reading the angle that you're going to shoot downhill, it'll actually change the distance that it's going to tell you that it is because you're not going to need as much hold on a target shooting downhill because you're shooting with gravity. But that's an entirely different video in itself. But it works out for you, basically, which is always good. Uh, you've got the ballistics mode, which we've already shown you by the uh, applied ballistics. And then you've got scan, open scan, press the button, hold it down, and you can just move around scanning everything that you want, and it's all good. Um, full HD optical system inside these as well with the XR lens coatings. Um, I've got to read it off this because I don't know all this fancy stuff. Uh, dielectric prism coatings inside on the prism system. These are nitrogen purged. You've got a tripod adapter on the front there for if you want to mount these via the uh, Vortex spigot onto a tripod. And your battery goes in just underneath their battery supply for these as well, which is uh, also a winner. The rubber coating on here is fantastic for use in the field. However, for day to day, uh, if you're chucking these around in a bag and stuff like that, I do find that everything sticks to them, everything wants to stick to them. Um, but I'm hoping after a while that that kind of stickiness will uh, come off, come off them to be fair. But yeah, fantastic set of binos. We'll go through what's in the box. So this is the box it comes in. All very nice as you can see, good not scrimped. First thing you'll find is your product manual. This just gives you all of the information on the actual binos themselves and shows you the runabout of exactly what buttons to press for what. You've got the past inspection card for your warranty. Um, every single pair comes with one of those that's uh, individually signed. You've got the instructions on setting up the bino harness, which is ideal. And then you've got the actual ballistics manual. This is going to show you how to enter your data via the app and sync it with the binos. Read this. Read it and understand it, take it in, and make sure the data you enter is correct. Because if you enter the correct data into this, it'll be absolutely mint, trust me, it really will. So that's that. Your glass pack that's provided is here. Considering these are free, they're a really nice little glass pack. You can't really grumble. It's gonna keep the weather off it, off your gear. All your straps are in there as well. It's gonna protect your binos and it's gonna do a cracking job. So that's that. So these were available from us at Bailey's. Um, we've got them in stock. Um, this isn't just a, a video trying to sell them to you. It's not a review in that respect. I'm just letting you know what you get. Um, but we're firm believers in we sell what we use. So at the end of the day, I go out in the field. I use these like I do now since I've had them. Uh, and I'm keeping them. They're not, they're not going anywhere. Um, <laughs> unfortunately, the wife wouldn't be too happy. But I'm going to keep these. Um, so that's how much I really, really like these binos. Um, so yeah, we've got them at baileyshooting.co.uk. Get yourself over there. If you've got any questions, by all means, uh, if you're friends with me on Facebook, drop me a message or via the Facebook group or the page, Bailey Shooting, or even on Instagram, just, uh, just drop us a message or even on Google, actually. You can drop us a message on there now um, and I'll answer any questions that you've got. But if you enjoyed this video, please give us a, a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and I'll, uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.